What's up guys, back with another video. Something a little different today. Back with some car stuff, but my own car stuff. Because I uh, got rid of my Jetta. I had a Mark V Jetta that I had for 12 or 13 years or something. It was my first car. And finally decided to let it go. And uh, it's been rough. But um, I replaced it with a... 2016 golf sports wagon it's the 1.8 turbo um i'm super excited to be honest because i've always wanted a wagon and i was gonna get a jetta wagon but um i seen these and i just like these so much better the front ends look way cleaner the tail lights and rear end look way cleaner the tail lights like the back end looks so much nicer in my opinion compared to the Jetta. The front end, I love the front end way better. It's basically the Golf, just the wagon version of the Golf obviously. But um, it has some de decent uh, up, not upgrades, but I'm not even sure what model this is. I want to say it's the SE, but I'm not entirely sure. Um, but it has a light, like the gray leather interior, which is nice. I don't know if you've seen, but the panoramic moonroof or sunroof. Um, I have all the kids stuff back here, but came with all weather floor mats. Bunch of room in the back, which is huge. We just went grocery shopping have the stroller my tools and we're able to fit all the groceries back there which is really nice but the keyless entry and lock um the lane uh i forget lane uh, not assist but um oh blind spot it's super clean there's just a, a little few things that um that it needs but other than that I'm the second owner, it has 77,000 miles, clean Carfax, like this thing was super clean for the deal I got it for. So we end up driving a little over two hours out to uh, just past San Diego to Al Cajon, I think, or Al Centro to pick it up. And it was definitely worth it, definitely worth it. There's a few things I wish I got, but it is the automatic. I drive a lot like for work so um, living in California and traffic I wish I had the manual but um, it's more convenient for the auto especially like with the kids and it's just more convenient to have an auto car especially with all the driving I do so yeah that's pretty much it um, I'm pumped yeah, I want to get this thing up in the air. I want to kind of do my own inspection. They did their uh, own, they have their own mechanic shop. They did their inspection. The car, people that they got it from did their own inspection. Everything clears out. But I figured I'd crawl under there and see uh, if there's anything I, I notice or I see. There's definitely a lot I want to do. I got a few little dumb stuff um, ordered, like... The LED headlights and um, I'm going to get a lip and just little stuff like that for now. Don't want to go too crazy. It is going to be my daily driver. So just something clean and simple. The the dad wagon is, I think that's my new Instagram name. <laughs> Getting this thing bagged, I think that's the plan. Because to buy coilovers and stuff, I'm going to end up bagging it later on. It's more practical for the wife and kid and stuff right <laughs> so um i found a kit it's at the, the top of the budget but i think it'll be worth it instead of settling for coilovers and wheels now i can just get the bags and wait on the wheels till maybe the end of the year but at least it'll be slammed throw some cheap spacers on the stocks just to get them poking out a little not poking out but get the fitment to look a little bit cleaner 